So the next question was, in how many ways can Kimberly choose to invite her seven friends over for a sleepover, assuming that she has to invite at least one friend over? And that is a key word here, key phrase, is at least one friend. So she can invite one friend, two friends, three friends, right up to seven friends. Now, the qu next question is, is order important? Is this And in theory, the order she invites her friends over, so if she invites Rachel over and Tina over, that's uh, the same as inviting Tina and Rachel over. The order that she invites them is not important. Um, but so this is going to be a combination. So the way, number of ways that she can invite one friend over, and I've done the calculations here. So if she chooses to invite one friend over, then this is a combination of seven choose one. So there are seven ways she can invite that one friend over. If she's gonna invite two friends over, there it's gonna be the combination of seven choose two, which is 21. The combination of seven choose three is 35. The combination of seven choose four is 35. Then the numbers start to repeat. So seven choose five is 21, seven choose six is one, seven, and seven choose one is one. And if you total this up, you get 127. Now, I wanna go back to Pascal's triangle and point out something to you. So if we look at the sum of row one, so the sum, I should say row zero, it is one and the sum of so that's row zero and so row one is the one plus one which is two row two the sum is four and for row Three. One plus three plus three plus one sorry, is eight. So row three is equal to eight. Now, we could also write this as two to the zero, two to the one, two to the two, two to the three. And if we count down here, you'll notice here's our row That we were just looking at. And this is row seven. And the sum of the numbers in row seven is two to the seven, which is 128. So we could have used the indirect method by using the Pascal's triangle and knowing that the sum of row seven will be two to the seven, because then there would be the number of ways would be that she could invite at least one friend over would be the total number of ways, which is 128, minus the number of ways she could invite zero friends over, which is one way, So the number of ways that she could write, invite zero friends over, so this would be 128, would be the total number of ways that she could invite anywhere from zero to seven friends over, minus one, which is the number of ways that she could invite no friends over, which would be seven choose zero, which is, zero, is one, and so this comes out to be 127. So we can start to use Pascal's triangle to make some of these questions a little bit easier.